Hey guys, your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new, you are welcome. Guys, have you seen my boyfriend? My boyfriend? Have you seen my boy, my boy? Have you seen my boy, my boy? Have you seen my boyfriend? Is anybody looking for their boyfriend? Their man. Their man. Does anyone say boyfriend anymore? I guess the younger people do. People say, that's my man. My man, my boo, my bae, my, my man, the mister, right? If you ever find me looking for my boyfriend, guys, slap me upside my head. Have you seen my boyfriend? Hell no, girl. You don't date no boys. All right, guys. I need lotion on my hand, but it is what it is. It is what it is. I just wiped down the table with some spray and stuff. Let me be. All right, guys. Don't forget to flip these energies. It could be for you. Maybe not. Right? Could be your person's energy and what they're going through. We're starting with Kipper. Kipper tells everybody's business. It just it just lays it out. All right, guys. Holy Spirit, what's going on for the collective? Ooh, a message of concern. Some lady is about to receive a message, and it's going to be quite concerning. What would that message be? What would that text message be? Ooh. Great fortune? Is she going to get a message about great fortune? Is it going to be money? Is it going to be a check in the mail? Is it going to be you're going to receive this? Is it going to be a new job? Is it going to be you just won? Is it going to be the winning lottery ticket? What? What is the great fortune? Right? I need to go buy a lottery ticket today. Um, you just never know. <laughs> you just never know. She may be getting a message about a great fortune. Or she may find out that somebody else just got rich. I don't know. We have a child here. That could also be a new beginning. Maybe she's going to get this new fortune. It's going to be a brand new beginning. Like a brand new baby. What else is going on? Maybe you're going to win in court. This is unexpected money, sunshine. My sunshine, this is unexpected money. This is something new. A child. You're either going to win in court, maybe child support, but this is a great fortune. So I think you're going to receive something. It could be that winning lottery ticket. Y'all, everybody go out and get a lottery ticket today. Get one ticket every day this week, the rest of this week, or for the rest of this month. Get one ticket a day. It's a dollar or two dollars or whatever it is. But it's definitely unexpected money, possibly new beginnings. And whatever this great fortune is, this new beginning, this unexpected income, is going to be change. You're going to be moving. You could be moving. I don't know. Um, maybe you're going to sell your house or something. Maybe you've been trying to sell your house. I don't know. But this is about a lady. And a great fortune that you are about to receive. Uh, claim it, guys. Claim it. In the name of Jesus. Okay? Claim it. What is going on here with this lady here? This this sounds like good news. Maybe you've been waiting on something. We have a seven of pentacles in reverse. Maybe something wasn't working for a while. Maybe you weren't reaping what you sold for a while. Let's find out. Let's just keep going on. But you're hopeful. I think for a while, things probably wasn't coming in for you. And then you're hopeful, so that great fortune is going to come in for you. You have a page of swords. People could be watching you. People got their eye on you, sunshine. What's going on here? Six of Cups. Someone from your past may come and pay you a visit. What is this? Maybe you're going to get a message that the person from your past won a great fortune and they're coming back to get you, right? But somebody from your past is coming. Somebody's not manifesting or standing in their power.
There's definitely change of foot. Someone from your past is coming back, or you may even be thinking about someone from your past. But they could be. Ah, okay. You may get a message that something wasn't working. You may find out that somebody involved other people. Maybe a person found out that other people were involved. But whatever it is, they're not dealing with these people anymore. It's a Knight of Wands in reverse. Someone could have got cheated on here. And now they're watching you. Maybe they want this new beginning with you. Maybe it's going to bring in a great fortune for you. I don't know. Yeah, somebody was manipulated. King of Swords in reverse. So you may get a message about this man. And that whatever he was in isn't working anymore. Or maybe he's going to come to you. Maybe he won a great fortune and he wants this new beginning with you, which will bring you unexpected income if that's what he wants with you, right? That's what he wants with you. Yep. He's leaving somebody out in the cold. Somebody's coming towards you, and I think you're going to get a text message first. They may even call you. It could be a voicemail. You know what today so. But you're definitely going to get a message, and I think he's going to tell you that whatever he was in wasn't working. He just wants to agree to disagree. Doesn't want to argue and fight about it. But he could be in a midst of change. So you're going to get a message that someone... Yeah, here's the Queen of Wands, Knight of Wands. Remember here, guys, I said this person had... Um, they were involved with other people. And maybe this man is just not going to stand for it anymore. Could have left this woman and thinking about you. This is somebody from your past is thinking about coming back. They feel like they chose wrong. Their person cheated. Seven of Cups in reverse. They're going to feel like they chose wrong. This person is going to come back to you with a pocket full of change. They feel manipulated. And now they're going to take this leap of faith here. Maybe they won a great fortune. Maybe they won in court. Maybe they got divorced. Maybe they sold their home. You know what I mean? They could be moving to a different location. This person from your past. They're a hermit. They're just not saying anything to you about it. They probably haven't reached out to you. You probably don't even know this is going on. This could be somebody from your deep past. A year ago, two years. Somebody from five years ago. Right? But... They're not up in their head. They're not undecided. They're definitely agreeing to disagree. They're leaving somebody. So somebody's going to reach out to you and they're going to say, it's over. They're going to say, I'm divorced. They're going to say, I won in court. They're going to say, whatever, 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 whatever. But something didn't work for them. They could have some delays right now. Or the person that they're leaving doesn't want them to walk away. What is this? Eight of Cups in reverse. So whoever they're walking away from does not want this man to walk away. But he's hopeful nonetheless about going forward. Nine of Pentacles. He's actually hopeful that you're single when he does reach out to you. He could have been watching you. Page of Swords energy. Could have his eyes on you. He's just up in his head about you because he's unsure. He could be watching you on your socials or whatever. But he's definitely dropping his burdens. And thinking about the past. Somebody from your past is coming back. And he's hoping that you're single. They're probably not following their intuition right now as well. They're holding back because they refuse to be put in competition with other people. They're not giving to that energy anymore. And they started following their intuition. They realized that their person is cheating on them or have cheated on them. They feel manipulated as well. And they used to have fear about them, but they don't have that fear anymore. They're walking away. They have healed their heart from whatever happened here. These cards are read one after the other. They are frustrated, though, I guess because of what went down. Yeah, they're ending things with this Queen of Wands in reverse. Two of Cups in reverse. They're ending things. They feel like they chose wrong. 
and they want you back. Death card in reverse. They want you back. Someone from your past is going to take this leap of faith, guys. They're coming in. I guess after they win, maybe win in court. And whoever they're with does not want this person to leave them. Three of Wands in reverse. Or maybe they just haven't quite walked away yet. This is an emperor. Standing in their power. In hermit. They're just being quiet. They're walking away from a situation, guys. And they're coming to you. Ten of Cups. They're coming to you. Oh my gosh. Holy Spirit. Clarify this message of concern. Page of Cups. Somebody is going to make you a love offer. Some type of a way. Knight of Cups. Page of Cups. Knight of Cups. Somebody's gonna, somebody from your past is going to make you a love offer. Spirit, clarify this great fortune. It looks like he won something. Maybe he found out that wasn't his child. I don't know. The Empress. You're going to be receiving a great fortune. When this man shows up. Holy Spirit, clarify this child here. This is the King of Wands. I think that's a new beginning. Maybe he's going to come in and tell you that. That he wants a new beginning with you. A second chance. Unexpected income. This person is not up in their head, I guess, when it comes to you. Holy Spirit, clarify change. Queen of Cups in reverse. They're changing. They maybe feel like whoever they was with didn't love them anymore. They've healed from it. And here they go, swimming away to calmer waters. Guys, this reading was read card by card. Somebody from your past is coming back. They could have won in court. Maybe you know that they was getting a divorce or something. Um, maybe this man is rich, you know, and he's just he's just coming in for you. Let's pull some more. Holy Spirit, clarify this gentleman that's coming in for the collective. Somebody from your past. He's in despair right now because he's definitely going through a lot. He may have a gift for you when he shows up. He's in despair. Maybe over this privileged lady. I don't know. Maybe she felt for privilege. But he has a gift for this woman here who's working. Who works hard. She works hard for the money. He's going to come in and you're not going to have to work anymore. But I say keep working. Do what you do. Do what you do. It's been a long journey for this man. Maybe she just had her hands out because he does have a great fortune. You know, and she became privileged. And she was like, well, I need and you give me and you take care of me and this and that. And I'm going to live my soft life. Let it go, people. He realized this was a false person. It was a false person. Your man is coming. An official person, lovers, main male thief could have found out that this woman was a thief. I don't know. Here you are. He wants to court this lady here who's working hard. The same woman here who's working hard. He's coming in to get you. He's coming in to get you to change your life. All right, guys. Somebody from your past is coming back, and they're coming back with a pocket full of money. And there's nothing wrong with that. <laughs> That's not wrong with it. Just don't use this person. Be appreciative. Do not become the privileged lady thinking that you owe me and I deserve. Do not be the I deserve woman, right? You give, they give. You give, they give. You receive, they receive, right? They can probably give more than you, but that doesn't mean you don't give. And continue working. Continue doing what you're doing. And it is what it is. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.